In this video, we'll be showing you how you can mount your Pro 10 LED on the inside of your mesh top vivarium. The easiest way we have found to do this is to use two pieces of material to sandwich the mesh. This will spread the load and not stress the mesh out at all, causing it to bend or buckle. The easiest material we have found to work with has been wood. What you need to do, you need to choose three screws of the correct length so they can screw the two halves together through the mesh. The next thing you need to do is to find two more screws that will easily slide into the top of the Pro 10 in the cleft. This will make it a lot easier when fixing the Pro 10 inside the Viv. Paint your two pieces of wood the same colour as your vivarium so they will match in. We've also pre-pilot drilled ours and made sure that they fit together nicely so you're not struggling when you come to put them inside. Using a tape measure, accurately measure where you want these pieces to be. This will make it a lot easier when it comes to locating them and fixing them. Locate the second half inside the vivarium and screw the two pieces together. This is generally easier if you start in the centre because you already have a pre-drilled hole that you can screw straight into. Put your two screws in that you're going to need to mount your Pro 10 onto. These need to be close enough together so that it will slide on there with ease. Slide the unit onto the screws. This should fit snugly, but it may require some adjustment. Tidy up your cables and route them where they need to be making sure that they're all neat inside and that nothing's hanging down. And then reconnect it to your power supply. Once it's plugged in, you're good to go. And it's now ready for you to use. One thing we will also notice with moving your light inside you should have an increased light output by approximately 30 to 40%, which will also be beneficial to your plants.
hope you found this video helpful and we'll be back with some more tips and tricks soon.